Welcome back to my little video series about Fancy Menu. Today I want to talk about how you can make your own slideshows for Fancy Menu and um, yeah, that's that's much easier than than animations. It's it's pretty easy. Uh, shouldn't take longer than yeah, like 10 minutes or so. So to make your own slideshow, you first need to open the .minecraft folder and go to the config folder, then Fancy Menu and slideshows. Should be pretty empty in here, but yeah, we will change this now by creating a new folder. You can pretty much name this like you want. Um, I will just name it my spe special slideshow. And yeah, um, this is the folder you you put all your slideshow files in now. So you make uh, you need to to create one folder per slideshow you want to make. This is the one we will use this video. We go into this folder and we create a new file, a new text file, and call it properties.txt and we open it. Yeah, in this file you pretty much um, put all your um, slideshows properties like the duration um, per image, you know, the, the um, duration every image is shown before it goes to the next image, the next one. Um, or the fade speed, like uh, in which speed it's, it fades to the to the next image and yeah, such stuff. So um, these properties um, need to have a special like like layout, let me call it layout because I don't know a better name for it. It should look something like this. Um, the type needs to be the same every time, so just leave it as slideshow. Uh, you should um, add three spaces before every property. I don't think that's really important, but just do it because I'm really not sure anymore. Um, the name, the first, the first property is the name property. The name will show up in stuff like the editor, so you can identify your um, slideshow later. I will just give it the same name as I named my folder before. I, I think this was my special slideshow. All images in your slideshow should have the same size or at least the same aspect ratio, but even better the same size. So you can use a, a um, unified value for the width and height properties. Um, these are pretty much only useful when uh, for when you import an animation to a layout. Uh, it will, in most cases, it will get scaled down to like 100 by whatever pixels. And yeah, it will use the aspect ratio for this. So if you don't use the correct ex uh, aspect ratio here, it will yeah, fuck up your your um, slideshow size, and you don't want this. In my case, I will just use one thousand uh, nine hundred twenty by one thousand eighty here because yeah, I don't know the actual size of my images. They are not even close to the same size. So yeah, just just imagine they are the same size. You can ignore these two. Just just um just include it, so yeah, set set zero to both. Uh, the duration is for uh, how long every image is shown before it goes to the next image. It's in seconds, so uh, in this case five um, seconds per image, then it goes to the next image. self explain The fade speed is the speed in which an image fades to the next one, so after, in this case, the five seconds uh, it will fade to the next one and the speed in which it fades is this value. So uh, one is the default speed or should be the default speed. Two is um, double the default speed and 0 0.5 is half the default speed. It's decimal values so you can't use negative ones. This wouldn't work. Just use values like these to um, to slow down the, the fade speed. And yeah, I will just leave it as 12. That's pretty much all uh, properties and slideshow has. So uh, I will I will uh, upload this this file and put a link to it in the description, so you can just copy it. Yeah, um, that's that's pretty much all. One thing I sh I, I forgot before is uh, this um, uh, this name needs to be unique, so you can't use the same name twice. Just just uh, if you have very similar names, just do it like this to make them unique. And yeah, uh, we will save this now and close it.
because we are done with the properties. So now we need to add our images to the slideshow. Well, it's pretty obvious why we need to do this. So in the same folder as we created our properties.txt file before, our slideshow folder in config, fancy menu, slideshows, we need to um, create a new folder in here and we need to call it images. And yeah, in this folder we need to put all of our uh, slideshow images. All images of your slideshow need to be a um, need to be PNG or JPEG images. No other file types are allowed here, so don't try to use GIF or whatever. Yeah, so um, these are the the images we want to add to our slideshow. We just put it in here, and now we need to. Um, Actually, if we don't care about the the order of the images, we don't give it. Uh, we don't need to give it a, a special name. But um, if we need to order them by by like uh, let's call it frames. But yeah, don't don't try to use this as as animation um, alternative. Yeah. So if you want to have the the images sorted, we need to uh, um, call them by by numbers, like like that. Um, and now this will be the first image that's displayed and this will be the last image pretty pretty self-explaining so we are pretty much done here now we have our properties.txt file with all necessary properties we have our images in the images folder these are the images that get displayed later as actual slideshow and yeah um, we already have our our slideshow in the fancy menu slideshows folder so we just need to click on reload now in fancy menu to reload the mod and now we can uh, or we should be able to use the the animation in our uh, layout editor so we click on edit for the main layout click uh, right click the background and click on new element to add a new slideshow and yeah now we see our my special slideshow slideshow we click on it and then it's here. Five seconds per image, and then it fades to the next one with a speed of 12. Uh, a speed of one is actually pretty slow, so I just set it to, to 12. And yeah, that can be used as normal um, element, like, like a normal image element. And you can also use it as background by clicking on set background. Uh, go to slideshows and uh, select the, the right slideshow here. In my case, that's the my special slideshow slideshow. We click on set background and now we have it as background. This can be pretty useful if you uh, just want to make a quick and pretty looking layout for your mod pack or something. Yeah, it's, it's, an, uh, it's a simple but, but effective feature. That's pretty much all you need to know about slideshows. We we will just save it now by clicking on or by pressing uh, Control plus S. Now we close it, and yeah, we have our random background here. Well, I need to disable these uh, to see the the new slideshow. Now we see it. So here we have our pretty uh, pretty looking slideshow. You can you can use uh, them as as element and background in the same in the same uh, layout, but it will just always show the same content. You just uh, it, it's not it's not a, a another instance. It's all the same instance, and yeah, it will just render twice. So if you want to to uh, have similar images in in uh, slideshows but you want uh, you don't want to to have them display the same image you need to make two slideshows with the same images and all of them and in a different in a different order or something that's that's how it is i hope this was at least a bit helpful and i hope to see you in the next video bye